Now at six, Spark on the Circle back for its second year. The campaign will be returning to historic Monument Circle in downtown Indy. CBS 4's Claire Curry spoke with organizers about their plans for this summer attraction. Where I'm at on the northwest side of the circle, this will soon be transformed into a space where people can enjoy live music, play games, or eat lunch with their friends and family. Spark really is about giving people a reason to experience Monument Circle differently. After seeing 78,000 people come through last year, the quadrant will be closed yet again for vehicles, providing a pedestrian-only experience. Having an area where people can come and congregate and enjoy themselves and relax within the city is an excellent thing to do, and it will definitely draw people back. Visitor Michael Scanlon sat at the circle this afternoon with some downtime during a conference, and he can envision himself visiting again with the appeal of the community space. Live music will be a big element to draw people in, and they will stay for that, and uh, also artists' presentations. Downtown Indy Inc. and their partners say the experience came to be for not only visitors, but also regulars. But it was also people who were enjoying downtown for so many of the reasons that people utilize downtown. It was workers in office towers. It was the 29,000 residents that call downtown home. Last year, over 250 programs popped up on the turf. In a new addition, in tandem with Spark, the original farmer's market will be on the opposite side for certain days of the week. We want to bring in other community partners to be able to highlight what they do, to be able to really celebrate the legacy of Monument Circle as a community gathering place. Easy, busy, busy cake. With the success of the 2023 season, organizers are ready to set up the temporary meeting space as quickly as possible. In addition to a little bit of a geographically different location on the circle, we'll also see that programming start earlier. Spark should be set up starting on June 1st and continue until November 3rd, and a modified version will be up during the holidays. In downtown Indy, Claire Curry, CBS 4 News. Claire, thank you. Well, we